<laughs> Hi, everybody, and welcome to another week of English 10 with Holbert and Rivera. Um, coming to you live from the outdoors. Hey, it's a thing. Yay. Check it out. <laughs> um, we have a short video and a short assignment for you all this week, so let's get started. So first of all, uh, we want to go over some thesis statement things with you this week. We also want to do a real talk. Hobart's coming with some serious information this week. Um, and then I'm going to go over your assignment for the week. We're going to do appreciations. And then our last slide is going to be a recap of this whole video in a minute. Yay, starting with our thesis statements, just do them. Just submit them. Um, this slide is basically just telling you that if you haven't submitted by this morning in the grade book, that little M for missing is gonna turn into an INC for incomplete. That's worth a 0% and you will see a drop in your grade. Um, so that's what this slide is telling you. So please, please, please just get it in as soon as possible. Never forget, we believe in you, but now it's time for some real talk. Um, and again, I, it, it pains my soul to say this. Y'all, if you have not submitted your Dear Martin essay, most likely you will not progress on to English 11. As so in it, next year. As in you're going to have me with all of the current freshmen again next year. Um, and that's just the reality of the situation. That's what it is and we have to move forward with that knowledge please, please, please reach out to me. Many of you have, and I am so grateful for you from the bottom of my heart. If you're still waiting for a response, that's next. Um, but again, the reality is y'all, if you don't do this essay, you're repeating English 10 and that that's it. I, I can't, I can't be more clear than that. Um, I've adjusted the assignment for you. I've sent emails. I've called a lot of your homes. Please meet me halfway. Okay. Um, again, everything can be submitted late for full credit. I mean, right? Like nothing is being lost because you're turning in late, right? Like I'm just gonna grade what you turn in. Um, but please, by June 11th, you need to get that in or else most likely you're not progressing on. Word. I'm just gonna say distance learning, y'all. Like I know there's tons of excuses and I know there's tons of things that you're dealing with. So communicate that. If you communicate that, um, that's better that's better than nothing okay. yes. your project for english 10 the covid 19 either art or instagram or podcast or video is due june 4th at 8 p.m via google classroom and we're going to post an assignment that you should attach the links or the video files or the audio files um, or the pictures to and by the way thank you to those of you that watch these videos we're trying to clarify things as much as possible um, I'm not gonna post that assignment like submission form until Thursday because I don't want to confuse people so we want you to work on it but don't turn it in until the earliest will be Friday okay that's so that we don't confuse the people that don't watch these videos watch the videos <laughs> um, assignments for yeah. the week. Assignments for the week, again, are, they haven't changed too much from last week, but you do have a new form to fill out that will show up as a grade in your GA grade book. Okay, so please complete that form. It's super short. It's not asking you for a thesis or anything, so there's a new form. Do it. Second, please continue to work on your projects, okay? So that's due next Thursday, okay, next Thursday. Uh, what is that, nine days, Ms. Roberta? So please, please continue to work on it. Um, and then again, just get those thesis statements turned in through Google Classroom. Um, you can even, remember, DM me your thesis. I don't care, just get it to me in some way, please, please. Word. If you have any questions, please come to our office hours or email us. Hey, guess what? I got a teacher Instagram at Maestra Betsy on IG. Go follow, subscribe, like our videos. You know, yeah. Jill. <laughs> um, no grade in our English class is final until the last day of school, which is June 11th. And then I'm serious. Um, I'm putting in that M, which stands for missing. So if you ask me, like, hey, miss, why am I failing this assignment? Um, it's because you didn't turn it in, okay? Like, let's be real. If you don't turn in an assignment, you fail. <laughs> you fail. 
Your third assignment is to spend some time outside. Woo, it's hot. I know, maybe it has to be early, maybe it has to be late, but spend some time outside because it's good for the soul to just like not be looking at a screen for a minute. Thank you. That's what I'm, that's what I'm doing yeah. right now, but. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. And we have appreciations for a few people. So, Holbert, get us started. Yay! Uh, so, first and foremost, Eduardo. Uh, Lalo, I have heard from him. He has reached out, he has emailed. He is going to be taking initiative for his Dear Martin essay. I'm rest that goes well. I am so proud of him. And Lalo, definitely be expecting a reply from me within the next hour because you deserve it. And I love you and I miss you. But thank you for emailing. Yes. Well, let me give a shout out to now Danielle Ding because I don't know if we've ever done this, but <laughs> like, cause I forget, like sometimes I'm like, oh, we're trying to try to do new people. <laughs> and then I forget and I shout out the same person. My bad. Danielle, you deserve all the shout outs. First of all, you're a caring, loving, compassionate person. Um, and plus, you're so smart. You do all of these assignments and like you blow me away. So just know we see you. Thank you. Um, the next uh, shout out for me is a pair, um, Yareli and Alexia Rodriguez. Um, thank you. I, it's one thing to, to get on top of a project early, but it's another to almost finish that project, ask for feedback, and then be told, you gotta redo most of it. Um, and you did. You didn't, you didn't hear that and be like, well, I already tried, so no. You, you completely rethought it, you connected, you're working together. What more could we possibly ask for? So I appreciate you, both of you. Thank you, thank you. That's awesome. I would also like to appreciate some folks that don't normally get shout outs, um, including Gerardo, Alan B, Jose, including Gerardo, Alan R, Jose B, and Nasli. Y'all, keep turning your work, you're consistent. Maybe you don't email or check in with us or leave us comments or likes, whatever. Um, but I see you, I see you doing your work. And I want you to know, I appreciate you. Yes, yes, yes. Um, my next appreciation is actually for Angel Orozco. Um, Angel has already submitted his project. What? What? Um, and I'm so, so, we're both so, so proud of you, so grateful, so thankful. Um, it was great. It was great. Yeah. And I, and just, he's killing it. Like two weeks two weeks early he turned in his project so and yeah 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 and my last one is sarah ishisaka yo girl the movie project the thesis your essays your writing your thoughtfulness it's all on point i want you to know we haven't appreciated you on the video but we see you and we appreciate the work that you do um, and my final appreciation is for the students who have not necessarily reached out all semester, but are due now in time to really change your grade. I, I appreciate you. I see you, um, Julia. I, I got your email. I'm so thankful and grateful. Again, anyone who is reaching out to me saying, hey, please help. Please. I appreciate you. I love you. Here's the whole video in one minute. Your Google feedback form posted on the Google Classroom is due Thursday at 8 p.m. Yes, you do get a grade for it. It's so easy, you just answer the questions. Do it. Yes, your final thesis statements, turn them in ASAP, please. And your Dear Martin essay, please. Your final project for the COVID-19 inequities project is due June 4th at 8 p.m. I'm posting the place to submit that on Thursday so that there's no confusion. Um, but yes, you're working on that as well. Okay. Um, finally, our office hours. Um, mine are today from 3 to 4, and Rivera's is on Thursday from 1 p.m. or... I might change it, 9 p.m. I don't know. Just oh. look on the Google Classroom for the link. Yeah. Dope. Dope, dope. We love you all, and take care. Have a good week. Don't forget to spend some time outside. Okay. And watch your sugar intake, because yo... Sugar, it's more addicting than cocaine. I said it. I love sugar so much. It's backed up by science, okay?
Uh, dance party on the way out? Yeah, always. Always. Well. Okay. Okay. Hold on, I did try to learn the like savage remix. So if you don't want to see any of that, <laughs> go to the website. <laughs> I miss you. Oh. Okay. <laughs>